Hi, this is iPad Diary Quick Tips Narrator, The Robot Girl. The iPad Diary English channel will share some quick tips for using iPad, both as a desktop and tablet. As I use both Mac Mini, Windows computer, and a couple of iPads, I wanted to share files through my home network, rather than airplaying every time. You can do this by using the SMB file share feature on iPad OS 13 or later. I find it a very useful feature as you can easily move files between different devices. This video is about sharing files between Windows and iPads. For the sharing of files between a Mac and an iPad, please see the video link below. If you find this video helpful, make sure to hit that thumbs up button, so that more people looking for the same solution can view this video. You first need to set your windows for sharing. Go to Windows Search. Type Sharing. Select Shared Experience Settings. Make sure nearby setting is set to On. Share it with everyone nearby. Set Share Across Devices. Go to Windows Search. Search and go to Control Panel. Then select Network and Internet. Select Network and Sharing Center. Then, from the left sidebar, select Change Advanced Settings. Go down to File and Printer Sharing and turn it on. Save the new settings. Now you need to find the IP address of your Windows PC. Go to Windows Search again and enter Ethernet. Select Ethernet Settings. Then select the network you are connected to. On the page that appears, scroll down, and you will see your IP address. You will need this address, later when you connect to this PC, from your iPad. Copy it somewhere for reference later. Now we are ready to access your Windows files from an iPad. Launch the Files app on your iPad. I already have my SMB sharing set up, so I will delete them. You see the files on my Mac Mini, that's already connected. Now, on the top of the left side menu bar, click the three dot icon. From the drop down menu, select, connect to server. You will notice that my previous connection is still there, but you will input your own IP address that you noted down. Simply add the server path as shown, with your IP address. Tap the connect button on the top right corner. It will ask for your login info. You have to use the credentials that you use to log into your Windows PC. Then hit next on the top right corner. It will take you a few seconds when you first log in. Voila, now you will see the folders on your Windows PC. Now, I wondered how fast I can connect to these files and, it was a whole lot better than what I expected. I tried opening a file on the PC and it opens fine on my iPad. Let's copy a file from the Windows PC to my iPad. I also copied the same file to my iPad from the PC, and was able to open it just fine. Here, I am copying files from my external disk attached to my iPad to the Windows PC server on the Files app, that I just created. As you will see, it was quite snappy. It took about 10 seconds to transfer the file. Hi, this is iPad Diary Quick Tips Narrator, The Robot Girl. The iPad Diary English channel will share some... I tried importing the transfer to the Windows file and, tried importing from the iMovie on iPad. Voila, I expected problems, but worked out fine, though it was a bit slow. I often have to access my Windows PC from my iPad, using a remote desktop application called Jump Desktop to perform work for hours, and this SMB feature will certainly improve my workflow. There you go, and peace.